Hey everyone, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel. You guys know what time it is. We're going to talk about Caspa, see what is happening with the price of Cas, and of course what is yet to come. If you do hold Caspa, this one right here is a very important update and actually not as bearish as you guys may think because I'm sure if you are part of the crypto markets, you, know, you do invest in cryptocurrencies, you guys know that, you know, over the last 24 hours, we did see, uh, you know, quite a bit of red across the market once again. And if you've been following me on my channel over the past few days, you guys know I've been anticipating this move. Uh, but with that being said, you're not seeing Casper reacting too much to this overall move. And that speaks a lot for itself. So buckle up uh, and, um, you know, Grab some popcorn, whatever the case may be, and let's get right into it. So if we're looking at the overall market, I'm sure you guys can tell at this point, you are seeing a, quite a bit of red across the board for the overall market. And obviously, if you're looking at it on the monthly time frame, I'm sure you guys have seen my emergency update for the broader market. You guys can see a lot of coins are down right now. Double digits, double digits across the board. But you're seeing Caspa up 4% on the monthly time frame. So it's pretty much outpacing 98% of the overall market over the last one month and a half. And I'm sure you guys know it has been outpacing it uh, if we're looking at the bigger picture as well. Uh, obviously, even if you compare it from the last 365 days, Caspa is one of the top gainers without a doubt. Obviously, because it was dirt cheap uh, 365 days ago. But now let's get right into it and see what exactly is happening and what is the exciting thing that I'm referring to but before we get into it as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency so looking at the price of caspa 17.10 cents down about three percent over the past 24 hours in usd comparative but we're up about 0.5 percent in btc comparative with the market cap still above four billion dollars to be exact about 4.13 billion and the 24-hour trading volume is at about 74.5 million and just by looking at this i am extremely extremely impressed the way caspa is holding and a lot of things will make sense once i pull out the charts so we're going to keep this a brief update um so let's get right into it so if we're looking at the dominance you know first and foremost we take a look at the dominance index if you are new to the markets start understanding how the dominance works and what correlation it has with the altcoin market you are seeing the dominance actually going up and again should not be a surprise we did see bitcoin going down when uncertainty um, increases within the crypto space you do tend to see um, obviously dominance kind of increasing because profits shift from altcoins to btc because bitcoin tends to hold better than the broader market and you can see this for yourself guys if you know your boy crypto zx literally mentioned this i said i had a gut feeling but we do break below the 60k and you can see this for yourself we touched the support line at the 5789 literally right on the neckline and saw a bounce and this is crazy to see i know a lot of people are going to come out and say crypto zx wow you know how did you see this and i do see some of these comments coming in but guys this is not rocket science it just takes practice it takes you know knowledge and you guys know I'm sh i've shared this um you know quite a bit um i've been in this space for eight years eight years and let me tell you boy it was not just a nice steady rise you, you know i've learned so much i've made so many mistakes and the same mistakes i've made i try my absolute best to try to uh, get my viewers you know my family the crypto zx family to not make those same mistakes again do not i repeat do not listen to the comments there are so many trolls out there that don't understand what the market uh, cycle is how the market works when you see those profits and if you're asking yourself in the head whoa you know this is actually too much uh, money well then guess what that is is the biggest sign for you to take some money off the table greed will not make you succeed in this market i've said this so many times and i will continue to emphasize this so i strongly encourage you guys even for the caspa community if you picked it up early on don't listen to these comments saying oh well caspa is going to go to a dollar you know why are you selling this and that if you picked it up 10 cents or lower and you're sitting at some massive life-changing gains then guess what it's not bad to lock in profits i kid you not and uh if you're looking at the price of caspa you know going back to the main point kind of got carried away but 
the overall market saw a bloodbath, right? We know about that. And Caspa is no exception. You know, Caspa made its way actually all the way down to the 16.5 cents once we did see this retest at 57,000 for BTC. So Caspa actually made its way down back to that level. But what the most impressive thing is, and it's continuing to prove what I have, you know, predicted for Caspa, that you know, of course, it's going to react to Bitcoin move. There's no exception, and it reacted to that. You can see this for yourself but it will bounce back up quicker and during times like this you know times like this right now what we're noticing you know this you know rebound is beautiful to say the least if you want to put this into perspective it's a three percent rebound i know a lot of people are going to be like oh you know that's nothing crazy but what if I told you we're pretty much a very, very close, if not at the exact same level where Caspa was yesterday when I made this update? Literally, let me give you guys a quick reminder. Take a you know closer look at the broader market. You're looking at ADA down 6.2%. And again, one of the biggest coins, right? By market cap. Jasmine down 13%. Pepe down 11%. Bonk down. VeChain. Pyth. See, algo, the list goes on and on and on, right? Um, and these ones that I have selected right now are down double digits. But you know, if you're comparing Caspa, it was down about 3.2 percent. So you can clearly see the difference. And what does this show us? You know, when you're looking at it, it's not just giving us, oh, you know, it has so much momentum. What this tells us that there's a lot of buyers right now, and not many people willing to sell their Caspa as of now but that does not mean now well, hear me out we've seen in the past we've seen in the past these sharp drops that does not mean you're not going to see we do not control right you know there could be a massive will that comes and decides you know what i'm gonna lock in profits and this is why it's so important to lock in profits at the end of the day uh so you know that's not in our control there could be a massive will that could come and you know just market to sell a coin their caspa coins and that is not in anyone's control but the way we're holding right now despite the overall market momentum you know is giving me really really good uh vibes for uh you know caspa and i'm thinking once bitcoin kind of consolidates right now we haven't really consolidated um and obviously let's hope we don't lose this support um but you know once it kind of stabilizes doesn't really have that much volatility within its price i'm expecting caspa will do some great things and um now of course a lot of speculation if you are um you know in this crypto space what i am thinking right now is whether or not there's some news that we do not know of of course we know there's a lot of good developments that could come out but is there an exchange listing possibly that's coming that's causing the price to hold so good right now um of course only time is going to tell but i'm really really impressed the way caspa is holding right now do let me know down below what you guys personally think what's your personal overall projections um but yeah thank you so much for your support we'll see you tomorrow in crypto zx and peace out